Hey, how's it going, everybody? Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com. Welcome to the update for Sunday, December 20th, 2020. Free pick in the NFL in a moment. First, a quick note, if you've yet to become a member at DocSports.com, just want to give it a trial run, click on the link below the video, get yourself set up for a free $60 account, and then you can use those free 60 bucks on any of my daily packages or anybody at DocSports.com. Again, it all starts by clicking on the link below the video. All right, uh, we're recording this as my lone college football game kicks off on Saturday, which is Stanford UCLA. My seven star, of course, was canceled. Uh, that was UL Lafayette. The Sun Belt Championship got canceled uh, a few hours after we released it a couple of nights ago, as we told you uh, on a, a past video. Uh, we got that going. And as far as everything else, well, we made a little profit in soccer. We had Everton plus a buck 60. They got the win over Arsenal, a four star play plus a buck 60 in soccer. Uh, we had a glitch with our college basketball no plays got out which is unfortunate but I will be in college basketball action on Sunday and uh, not only that but we've got three NFL plays for Sunday including my top play of the week a six star play cash last week with the eight star let's rack it up and do it again this week three NFL sides including the six star and I've got Monday and Wednesday college football bowl action my first two bowl games of the season so five football plays to go Sunday Monday Wednesday including that six star on Sunday's card also wanted to mention we'll be involved in soccer and college basketball on Sunday. Still got some UFC to go tonight also, and we'll report on that and how we did on Sunday night's video. Real quick note, as far as Joes versus Pros, only a couple of games uh, right now as we speak. The Tennessee Titans are getting about 58% of the tickets or the public action, and uh, they were laying 11 yesterday in the few books that had it, and of course they're down to nine now and the sharper action money coming in on Detroit, and of course that's all about the status of Matthew Stafford with that line being taken off the board in some books earlier in the week now back up coming down a couple of points the readjustment the other uh, Joe's versus pros right now at least the public's on Minnesota about 55% of the tickets nothing overwhelming and the money though is coming in a little bit more on Chicago throughout the course of the week that's from the minute the line was released right up until now a little bit more money on Chicago than Minnesota so not a lot of Joe's versus pros those two games though uh, stand out if you want to get an update check us out around noon or so Eastern time on Sunday check out an ESPN radio station in your location. We're going to be on a little bit early because they've got a college football uh, playoff show to do, but uh, we'll update all the betting numbers at that particular time. All right, let's get to our free play for Sunday. It's the Eagles at the Cardinals. Looking at all the books, Cardinals basically a six and a half point favorite. I thought the win last week was uh, by Philly was a fantastic spot to go against New Orleans. They had a sloppy win before that against Atlanta where they committed 10 penalties to one for the Falcons. They had this game this week against Kansas a city on deck. They had to face a team without having much game film at all other than college game film on, uh, on, on Hurts, on Jalen Hurts. And it was just a tough spot. They end up losing by three. They could have won the game. Uh, Arizona, though, now has game film on Jalen Hurts in this contest. And not only do they have game film on him, but also I think it's important to a handicap to realize that Arizona's defense has already faced Russell Wilson a couple of times and Josh Allen. So it's not like they don't face a mobile quarterback. And every day in practice, since he became a member and was drafted by Arizona, they're facing Kyler Murray, another great mobile quarterback. Quarterback. And by the way, speaking of Kyler Murray, most important to me, his shoulder looked fine last week after not looking so hot previous couple of games. And also, he ran the ball 13 times, so it was good to see Kyler Murray picking him up and putting him down again from a running perspective. And he got reacquainted with DeAndre Hopkins. He threw the ball at him, targeted him 11 times. Hopkins came up with nine grabs. So I think it's a tough spot for the Eagles here. We're going to recommend a play, a free play on uh, Arizona, minus the points over the Eagles on Sunday's NFL slate. Don't forget about my entire Sunday on my handicappers homepage, DocSports.com, led by that six-star play in the NFL. Five plays in football Sunday, Monday, Wednesday, college basketball, soccer, all that good stuff on Sunday's card. If you like the videos, click on the thumbs up button and be sure to subscribe. Do appreciate those who have done so thus far. I'm Scott Spritzer, DocSports.com. Let's put Sunday in the win column.